News now are from Bengal, where more curbs have been announced. In fact, it's a partial lockdown due to the rising COVID numbers. And uh, Bengal has limited guests at weddings to 50. Masks have become mandatory at weddings. Let's go across to Moni Deepa now for more. And Moni, tell us more about the kind of measures that have been announced. Well, uh, uh, today the new uh, uh, items of curbs are the limit on the number of uh, guests that can come to a wedding. That has been set at 50. There were curbs earlier, but they had become slack. And I do know that there were people who had organized weddings with 300 guests, but all that is now over. A maximum of 50 guests can come to a wedding, and they will be closely monitored by the authorities to ensure there is no uh, slip-up. Masks are mandatory. And uh, yesterday, in a huge list of curbs, the government had set time limits on bazaars. You know, there was uh, bazaars would be open only from 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. and then again from 3 to 5. Now, this limit will also apply to standalone retail shops. Uh, that is another decision that the government has taken clearly to clarify any confusion that may have happened. What is interesting, of course, is pharmacies, etc., are exempt. Uh, and so are, you know, your neighborhood grocer, your mithai dukan, the milk outlet, people who deal with, uh, or shops who deal with electrical goods. These have been kept out of the complete ban on, uh, you know, markets opening beyond the given times. On Friday, the government announced that cinema halls, restaurants, malls, beauty parlors, they were all to shut indefinitely or till further notice. The numbers in Bengal are rising, 17,000 plus. Yesterday, three days running. That has been the rate of new infections. 96 deaths yesterday in the last 24 hours. The government stepping up attempts to ensure things don't go out of control.